A busy side on the outbound section of the lagos Badu Expressway, especially in the early hours of the day, suggests that many are already leaving Lagos to other parts of the country for the Yuletide celebrations. But the outlook at Jibawu, one of the major hubs for interstate road travel, suggests otherwise. Patronage of transport companies and influx of travellers often noticed are low. By this time last year, the numbers of people who want to travel is small, but this time it has reduced drastically. So I think it's because maybe one, the security, and two, maybe the economic situation. During this kind of season, it takes at least 20 minutes. It should be full because the passengers, the numbers of people coming are more. But uh, right now, you can see people are still waiting. The time is, the sun is out and the people, passengers are not coming. The same situation applies to a Wena motor park in Ojota. The activities here are skeletal, with only few passengers on ground. We've been here since 6.30. This is the second bus leaving this, the park this month. Like, it will leave about 8.39, you know. And I think that's another one loading. But we are just going to our village, I mean to our town, all the time, not minding the expenses and not minding the situation. Even the kidnappers will never stop us because we know how to handle them. Compared to the previous years, by now a lot of people will have, will have, will have, will have, will have been on transit, but you can see the empty buses in there. So that's what tell you that the movement is, the turnout is so low. So because the, like the early in the morning, like five, six, it was relative as this. So people are not really traveling. While some travelers have resolved to stay back in the cities to celebrate quietly, others are determined to travel home against all odds.